Numbers chapter 18. And Yahweh said to Ahron, Thou and thy sons and thy father's house with thee shall bear the iniquity of the sanctuary, and thou and thy sons with thee shall bear the iniquity of your priesthood. And thy brothers also, the tribe of Lewi, the tribe of thy father, bring thou near with thee, that they be joined to thee, and serve to thee. But thou and thy sons with thee shall be before the tent of the testimony, and they shall keep thy charge, and the charge of all the tent, only they shall not come near to the vessels of the sanctuary and to the altar, that they die not, neither they nor ye. And they shall be joined to thee, and keep the charge of the tent of appointment for all the service of the tent, and a stranger shall not come near to you. And ye shall keep the charge of the sanctuary and the charge of the altar, that there be wrath no more upon the children of Israel. And I, behold, I have taken your brothers, the Lewiim, from among the children of Israel. To you they are a gift, given ones to Yahweh, to do the service of the tent of appointment. And thou and thy sons with thee shall keep your priesthood for everything of the altar and for that within the veil, and ye shall serve. I give you the priesthood as a service of gift, and the stranger that cometh near shall be put to death. And Yahweh spoke to Ahron, and I, Behold, I have given thee the charge of my heave offerings, even all the hallowed things of the children of Yisrael. To thee have I given them by reason of the anointing, and to thy sons as a portion for ever. This shall be thine of the most holy things, reserved from the fire. Every oblation of theirs, even every grain offering of theirs, and every sin offering of theirs, and every culpability offering of theirs, which they shall render to me, shall be most holy for thee and for thy sons. As the most holy things shalt thou eat thereof. Every male shall eat thereof. It shall be holy to thee. And this is thine, the heave offering of their gift, even all the wave offerings of the children of Yisrael. I have given them to thee, and to thy sons, and to thy daughters with thee, as a portion for ever. Every one that is clean in thy house shall eat thereof. And the fat of the oil, and all the fat of the vintage, and of the grain, the first fruits of them which they give to Yahweh, to thee have I given them the first ripe fruits of all that is in their land, which they bring to Yahweh, shall be thine. Every one that is clean in thy house shall eat thereof. Everything devoted in Yisrael shall be thine. Everything that openeth the womb of all flesh which they offer to Yahweh, both of man and beast, shall be thine. Nevertheless, the firstborn of man shalt thou surely redeem, and the firstling of unclean beasts shalt thou redeem. And those that are to be redeemed of them from a month old shalt thou redeem, according to thy estimation, for the money of five thakalim, after the thickle of the sanctuary, the same is twenty geras.
but the firstling of a cow, or the firstling of a sheep, or the firstling of a goat, thou shalt not redeem. They are holy. Thou shalt sprinkle their blood upon the altar, and shalt burn their fat for an offering made by fire, for an aroma of assuagement to Yahweh. And the flesh of them shall be thine, as the wave breast, and as the right thigh, it shall be thine. All the heave offerings of the holy things, which the children of Yisrael offer to Yahweh, have I given thee, and thy sons and thy daughters with thee, as a portion for ever. It is a covenant of salt for ever before Yahweh to thee and to thy seed with thee. And Yahweh said to Ahron, Thou shalt have no inheritance in their land, neither shalt thou have any portion among them. I am thy portion and thy inheritance among the children of Yisrael. And to the children of Lewi, behold, I have given all the tithe in Yisrael for an inheritance, in return for their service which they serve, even the service of the tent of appointment. And henceforth the children of Yisrael shall not come near the tent of appointment, lest they bear sin and die. But the Lewiim shall do the service of the tent of appointment, and they shall bear their iniquity. It shall be a statute for ever, throughout your generations, and among the children of Yisrael they shall have no inheritance. For the tithe of the children of Yisrael, which they offer as a heave offering to Yahweh, I have given to the Lewiim for an inheritance. Therefore I have said to them, Among the children of Yisrael they shall have no inheritance. And Yahweh spoke to Moshe, saying, Moreover, thou shalt speak to the Lewiim, and say to them, When ye take of the children of Yisrael the tithe, which I have given you from them for your inheritance, then ye shall offer up a heave offering of it. For Yahweh, a tithe of the tithe, and your heave offering shall be reckoned to you as though it were the grain of the threshing floor, and as the fullness of the winepress. Thus ye also shall offer a heave offering to Yahweh of all your tithes, which ye receive of the children of Yisrael, and thereof ye shall give Yahweh's heave offering to Ahron the priest. Out of all your gifts ye shall offer every heave offering of Yahweh, of all the fat thereof, even the hallowed part thereof, out of it. Therefore thou shalt say to them, When ye heave the fat thereof from it, then it shall be reckoned to the Lewiim, as the increase of the threshing floor, and as the increase of the winepress. And ye shall eat it in every place, ye and your households, for it is your reward in return for your service in the tent of appointment. And ye shall bear no sin by reason of it, when ye have heaved from it the fat thereof. And ye shall not profane the holy things of the children of Yisrael, that ye die not.